Hi folks, decided to show you a little project I've been working on. You all have heard about the programmable head USB keyboard dongle, where basically you load it up with keystrokes, you plug it in, and it automatically does things. You've also heard of hardware keystroke loggers, so that you can like see everything that someone's typing. Well, I decided to combine the two in this little device, which I'll be giving a demo of at uh, SkydogCon and Freaknik this year. And the core idea is, besides just waiting for environmental changes like lighting conditions or waiting for the caps lock key to come on and off you can do more to tell the programmable head when to actually dump its payload you can also log keystrokes in the meantime and it's also the reasons why you want to do this one thing might be to look for control delete type something tab type something enter and try to pluck out someone's username and password or you can just mess around with people or have a better idea what application they're in based on what keystrokes they've uh, typed in. Now this is a not quite ready for prime time uh, demo unit as you can tell because it's all breadboarded out and I had the part list on my website and uh, I'll put a link to that but let's actually see what this thing's doing. As you can see USB goes in, USB goes out and eventually I gotta figure out a way of doing better packaging for this. Now let's hope the demo doesn't fail as I try to show it. Now I have my keyboard right here and you're gonna have to take it on faith that I'm typing what I'm saying I'm typing. Okay. Now for a quick demo of some of the things you can do with something that's both a programmable head and a keylogger. Of course you can log keystrokes. I'm going to clear out anything I might have in there already by doing a control alt D. And um, let's type in something. Hello world. Now if I'm going to cover that, control alt L. And you'll see it's there in the log. I could also just pull out that SD card if I really wanted to and uh, cover the keystrokes that way. Now for some of the other payloads. You've seen Control alt l for showing the log and Control alt d for getting rid of the log. Let's say you want to modify something as someone's typing it. Let's say someone typed my name, A-D-R-I-A-N. Interesting modification. And you can also do something a little bit fancier. like. Let's, for instance, uh, type in something like, um, well, let's put this thing into law speak mode. We're now in law speak mode after hitting F12, and I'm going to type in something like, you can have a cheese burger. And if you notice, as soon as I hit that last key in the space, it modified the words. Or I can type in something like, why you know do something better. Or sometimes I have problems getting it to recognize things if I don't have space in front of it. So let's um, try something like this. Hello space why you know work better I don't know and it's got some other substitutions in there I need to add more but I think you get the rough idea of what all this thing can do um, these are all silly payloads like I was mentioning before there's much more uh, interesting payloads for a security guy to want to load on one of these or a pen tester, but hopefully it gives you just a rough idea.